what are we doing today? We are here at Circuit of the Americas, as you saw, for their first of 2023 cars and coffee at Circuit of the Americas. It's also a super lap battle, but we're not going in for that. Let's go find some cool cars. All right, y'all. Fortunately, I didn't do right on the microphones, and I didn't charge them. But let's check out these awesome cars. I'm voicing it over. This is an awesome Carrera 2 classic Porsche air-cooled. Looking super nice parked behind our Cayman. Uh, nice wheels, awesome cage. Check out this awesome McLaren. And the old guy in me is like, yeah, that's a cool McLaren. But this RS6 is super cool. Four-door wagon with the uh, you know rack on the top. Man, you can go anywhere in this thing. In comfort, with some speed. Love this RS6. Love the color. But this one caught my eye. I rolled in just after us this morning. FC RX-7. Second generation RX-7. Really cool. Right hand drive. Check out the license plate. Awesome. Uh, wide body fenders. Right hand drive with the cage. And of course the rotary. Very well done. Check out those work wheels. But check out this rotary engine. Accented really nicely. Awesome, awesome engine. I love it. This was one of my top favorite cars to see because I just don't see a lot of FCs. Awesome vehicle. Check out the interior. Yep. They did a really good job with this one. Now with the RS6, this is the predecessor to that. This is a, I believe, a third gen uh, wagon, so like, you know, late 80s, early 90s, uh, 5 Series wagon. Similar type of thing, similar type of color. I love it. I think it's cool. Don't see many of these around. Found a pair of beautiful RX-3s. RX-3s are not very common, at least not in this area of Texas. I don't see them very often. And these are two beautiful, beautiful cars. I love the color combinations. Very retro 80s style. Check out the wheels of the rotor. That's always cool. I haven't seen those before. Love the louvers on the back windows. And this is just a simpler version of the same generation RX-3, and I love it. Yes, this is a A90 Supra convertible. No, it's a Z4 uh, BMW. Still a very cool car. Uh, I've never seen one up close with the top down, so I thought it was really cool. Uh, nice interior. The engine looks like it's got some, you know, aftermarket bits, probably going a little faster than stock. And uh, I think it actually looks pretty nice. What do you like more? Porsche 911. This is a 991 generation, I believe. Uh, all the bits and pieces on the inside. Love the color. Digging the purple wheels. But check out that rear custom bumper. That's pretty cool. And it's an awesome crash bar designed to show off that big old turbo. And that turbo looks awesome. They did a really good job on this. Different. I like it. Do you? Hey, who doesn't like a classic VW bus? This one's super clean. And, you know, this is the perfect cars and coffee vehicle. Check it out, right? I mean, you show up, you chill, you get your coffee. It's an awesome vehicle. I love it. My favorite generation of Subaru is the GC8 Subaru WRX. Now, we only got them in a 2.5 liter RS. This looks like it could be that. It is a USDM car. Uh, it has awesome T37 wheels. Beautiful paint, that color. Um, that classic blue color. Now, I want to see what's under the hood. He just popped it. Let's go to the front. And it looks like it is a turbo STI engine. So, yeah. How about... EG or NSX. Most people would go for the NSX. I really like that yellow EG. I mean, you can't really go wrong with either. But that EG is super nice, super clean. Uh, loving the wheels. Just a really, really good job on that EG. 240Z. I believe it's a 240Z. Inline 6, of course. Nice larger wheels over than stock. Uh, I love the color. It's like a mustard yellow. Uh, it looks really, really good. I've seen this vehicle before, and, I mean, old Zs just look good. Can't get tired of old Zs. How about this awesome new Type R? This is the newest generation of the Civic Type R. I love it. It's a four-door sedan, 
It does have a hatchback, but it's more of a sedan look. I really like it. I think the stock wing looks awesome. The triple you know, exhaust looks kind of interesting with that uh, with the diffuser at the bottom. This is a Polestar 2, fully electric car made by Polestar. Uh, this is their second version. It looks almost like a crossover, but a sedan. I don't know what it exactly is called. It's a cool vehicle. I've never seen one up close. I know a lot of people don't like electric or aren't on board with it. I think it's a cool concept. You know my opinions on that if you follow. This interior is nice. It's a little bit less plain than uh, the uh, Teslas. Wide body Supra. They just look good wide body. This one's on air. Really nice representation. Black with a lot of carbon fiber, carbon fiber hood, carbon fiber fenders, carbon fiber front bumper. <laughs> so lots of carbon fiber. It looks really great. Got a lot of attention today. Here's a really cool AZ1 K car from Japan. This was not sold in the US. This is a JDM AZ1. Uh, it is a little bit engine car. They call it a K car because it's sub 1.3 liter. Very cool little sports car. You don't see many of these around. So this is a really nice clean representation of one. And right next to that, a couple of awesome Ferraris. Love the white. Uh, Ugh, excuse me, the white Turismo with this awesome 458 in charcoal. Beautiful interior. I mean, it's a Ferrari. And, of course, the back. Who doesn't like the back end of a Ferrari? That's an awesome car. 600 LT McLaren. Black. This is basically satin black with carbon fiber accents with the bronze wheels. This car looks really great. A lot of carbon fiber. The hood, the roof the roof scoop and it trails down to some parts of the rear including the wing you got the mesh over the engine so you can see that it looks really great with the exhaust pipes coming out of the back there on the top side awesome car and you know what pay attention to this someone call that number someone tell me what it says pantera not the band this is a detomaso dan pantera excuse me uh, rear engine or mid engine, uh, Ford engine if it's traditional, but it is a De Tomaso design. Beautiful late sixties, awesome mid engine sports car. The microphone trouble day, and apparently I didn't charge my batteries well, so we're going to the native microphone on the camera. Check out these Lambos though; these are nice, beautiful Lambos. It's a little windy, so if we get a pick of a little wind. I apologize. Got a Ford and a Chevy. And this beautiful Fairlane here. And this awesome Impala. Very cool Impala. Look how clean the interior is on this one. Very nice. And check out the Fairlane. Equally as nice. A pair of beautiful cars. There we go. Some more classic fun. It's a really nice Camaro. Looks like a Pro Touring style with 18, maybe 19 inch wheels. Very nicely done, love the blue. Nice variety today here at Circuit of the Americas. And it got packed. Y'all know I like the light colors with the dark accents. This Audi looks awesome. Very cool. And the little red accent on that, look good. Very, very nice. Check out this awesome carbon fiber side panel and if you hear the racing in the background super lap battles in full effect how about this beautiful nova very cool i love it pro touring big wheels beautiful interior check that out very well done well, wood manual brake set up. Looks like a nice 350 small block. Such a cool car. Well, it got busy. Check that out. Full house today at Circuit Americas.